The trees of the Lord receive all the rain they need. The cedars of Lebanon which he planted. The book of Psalms 104 verse 16. Without the sap, a tree cannot flourish or even exist. It is its very lifeblood. In the same way, vitality is essential to a Christian. There must be life, a vital principle infused into us by God the Holy Spirit, or we cannot be trees of the Lord. The mere name of being a Christian is but a dead thing. We must be filled with the spirit of divine life. This life is mysterious. We do not understand the circulation of the sap, by which force it rises and by what power it descends again. In the same way, the life within us is a sacred mystery. Regeneration is brought about by the Holy Spirit entering into a man and becoming a man's life. And this divine life in the believer afterwards feeds upon the flesh and blood of Christ and is in this way sustained by divine food. But how it comes and where it goes, who can explain to us? What a secret thing this sap is. The roots go searching through the soil, but we cannot see them sucking out the various gases or minerals, turning them into vegetable matter. This work is done down in the dark soil. Likewise, our root is Jesus Christ, and our life is hid in him, and this is the secret of the Lord. The roots of the Christian life are as secret as life itself. How permanently active is the sap in the cedar? In the Christian life, the divine life is always full of energy not always bearing fruit, but in inward operation. The believer's graces are not every one of them in constant motion, but his life never ceases to palpitate within. He is not always working for God, but his heart is always living upon him. As the sap shows itself in producing the foliage and the fruit of the tree, so with a healthy Christian, his grace is shown outside in his walk and conversation. If you talk with him, he cannot help speaking about Jesus. If you notice his actions, he will see that he has been with Jesus. He has so much sap within that it must fill his conduct and conversation with life. Amen.